congratulations. Thank you. Now I have to figure out new questions to ask you. Um, it's got to be an exciting night for you. You know, it's really exciting. We've been doing this since January, so this is a cul culmination of 10 months of really hard work. And I think my family will be very grateful that a meal can now be cooked for them rather than eating whatever we had in the fridge. So you call this a uh, margin of victory a mandate? I don't know if it's a mandate. What it's saying is that the voters agreed with my message of job creation, common sense in Lansing, and that we really need to turn our state around. How do you do that? You know, we have to work with everybody. We, we, uh, we have a lot of areas, whether you're a Republican or a Democrat, where we agree. And I think my time on the Portage City Council, I've been able to find consensus and work with my peers. And that's what I'm looking to do in Lansing, work with my peers, find out where we agree. And that'll get the ball rolling. When you start making the first decisions, it'll get the ball rolling so we can deal with the tough ones. You've got a new Republican governor, uh, in, uh, Mr. Snyder. He wasn't everybody's Republican choice. Uh, was he yours? Well, you know, the beauty of a primary is the number one vote-getter wins. And I was very torn in the primary. I felt that Rick Snyder, P. Hookstrom, Mike Cox, Tom George, Mike Bouchard, you couldn't go wrong. We had the most amazing contingent. I knew that I could work with any one of those men, and I'm, I'll be very happy to work with Mr. Snyder, Governor Snyder. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you.